Hi, I'm Ian Franken from Paul Centre Tunbridge. I'm the General Sales Manager and um, we were approached by uh, the uh, Rotary Club and the Lions to, uh, to sponsor the Tunbridge Half Marathon. And we ended up being the, uh, the key sponsor, the main sponsor, and uh, obviously delighted to be involved with the event. It's the first one, it's a big event for Tunbridge. There's 850 runners have crossed the, uh, crossed the line today, so again a fantastic event, obviously raising money for uh, the Kelly Holmes' Legacy Trust and the Kent Air Ambulance and Hospice in the Wheels. Very hot. <laughs> Very hilly. <laughs> it was a lot more challenging than I thought actually. It was a real thrill to see Kelly Holmes at the start, um, take whatever inspiration that can give you. And um, all the way along the course, lots of friendly uh, faces, lots of people um, well, uh, wishing everybody on, handing out drinks, uh, fantastic route, brilliant massage, uh, which I'm making the most of. It's, it's good, I really enjoyed it. It's got a variety, it's got some of the hills and the, the flat bits and it's just interesting. Yeah, I'll, I'll do it again. <laughs> Started off quick, got slower and slower. Last three miles were, um, yeah, were not the best of the race, as we said. You know, really been fantastic actually. First time I think you'd expect to, you know, you wouldn't expect it to be as slick as this. It was a great day for Tunbridge. Uh, the weather, all the athletes, it was absolutely brilliant. Yeah, I agree with that. I think there's, there's two things really. I think the event was successfully organised and everybody thoroughly enjoyed it. And it was great to have, to have the Tunbridge Lions Club and Tunbridge Rotary Club working together. It's been an absolutely fantastic event. Um, what I like about it down here in Tunbridge is the community feel. You know, you've had the Tunbridge Lions, the Rotary Club that have obviously been a big part of the organisation. Um, and then the three charities that are benefiting, the Kent Ambulance, Hospice and the Wheels, and my own charity, Dame Kelly Holmes Legacy Trust, and we do quite a lot of work in, in Kent. So I've done many of these events, um, you know, where I've kind of been part of it, done the starting, doing the medals, but absolutely everything. I think from a, a, a runner's point of view, I think they would find that the organisation's been really good. As I came through the town, you see the marshals are um, showing everybody where they should go. You know, the car park and the baggage has been all set up properly. We've got good massage facilities there for post event, the start, the funnel, you know, it's all been great. I think anything like this, big events, you know, if you can get involved as from a charity point of view, anything that is brand awareness, recognition, um, you know, helps at the end of the day. And so I'm really pri privileged that my charity was part of this event. It's been a long day. Yeah, I feel like I've done a half marathon myself. <laughs> you know, you start the event, you want to bring the energy into it. It was great to see other people running. And then, of course, I like to kind of give the medals at the end. And the reactions are just really funny. You know, the kind of come through delirious. And then I'm putting a medal around their neck. And I'm like, wow. But it's really good. I've been splattered by the sweat, but it was all worthwhile.